Bijan Robinson is one of the top young running backs in the league. Look at that move. And Arthur Smith just doesn't know how to use him. So we're going to help him out. He's on Robinson's only a 75. Nah, just kidding. He's really an 84, but we put him at wide receiver. And these are his stats, 91 speed, 92 excel. He's a very physical back. And his overview of play archetype says playmaker. So let's see if that's the case. So this play is designed for Bijan. He's all the way out to the right. This is like, bro, I don't think it's going to make much of a difference of him playing receiver. Let's see. No. Oh. No PI? No nothing? Um, I felt like that was a good pass. All right, we're going to try to hit Bijan up here. And play action. Boom. Easy. Oh, he drops that? Bro, he ha Oh, my gosh. Let's see if Bijan can burn these receivers or these DBs. Let's see. Oh, definitely. Definitely. Bijan, touchdown. Oh, he caught it. Let's go. Fourth and five. I'm going to run it with Cordero Patterson. Something tells me we can pick it up. Oh, we definitely can. All right. So, not bad. <laughs> we got Bijan to the left right here. He's going to run some 10 yard in. We got Cordero Patterson as well. Looks like they're running man. Boom. Ah, bad pass. Come on, Desmond. Come on, man. We should probably use Drake London as well. That's our that's our guy. Or Kyle Pitts. Kyle Pitts. Oh. Cordell, can you make the play? Can you make the play? Wow. Wow. Oh, Desmond. Okay. He saves the pick six. Nice. So we've got another red zone opportunity. We're only down a touchdown. I mean, we are facing the Panthers. Let's see if Bijan wants to get open. Ah. This is harder than I thought. Bijan's not really getting those much touches at receiver, but... I guess we'll have to play. Let's play it normally. Let's play like a normal offense. Maybe put Bijan in the slant so we can force him the ball. They sent a blitz. Easy. Bijan, touchdown number two, dude. He's mad fast, yo. We've got a third in inches here. We've got so many players in, on the field. And why not put Bijan on a slant <laughs> on third in inches? Easy. This man's Desmond, bro. Oh, my gosh. Dudes is garbage. Desmond, if you want to throw a nice pass, now would be the time. We have a fourth and inches. Good catch by Bijan. I, th I honestly thought he was going to drop that. So we're down a touchdown, and we need to score. I see Bijan is covered one-on-one. -on -one. Let's see if we can maybe burn the DB. Um, No, but Matt Collins did. What? Yeah, it's game over. It's game over. Stat line, 78 pass rate from Desmond Ritter. Chuba went off. Bijan had one carry for six yards. Even Ty Algier didn't even get a reception. Well, Bijan Robinson, five catches, 86 yards, two touchdowns. Not bad. Not bad. So we got to see how he plays it out with us not using the game, using his season. We're actually four and three leading the division. That's very shocking. Um, then again, NFC South sucks. Desmond Ritter, seventh in passing touchdown, 13 touchdowns, three picks. He threw two in that first game. So not bad. Not bad. Cordell Patterson's leading the way, running the ball, of course. Bijan Robinson's actually not doing too bad either. 18 carries, 67 yards, two touchdowns. And receiving, 27 catches, 321 yards, and four touchdowns. Not bad considering he's the number two receiver. And he's splitting reps with Mac Collins and Drake London. So that's actually really good. Um, four and three. We have a playoff spot so far. So let's see if they can keep it up. Wow. So they ended up winning the division nine, nine, wait, nine to eight. They ended up winning the division at going nine and eight. Obviously, the NFC South is pretty weak, but that's really good, honestly. So let's check out stats, how we did. Uh, Desmond Ritter was seventh in passing touchdowns, so offense propelled, and defense was fifth, so defense went off. 33 touchdowns, 12 picks for Desmond Ritter, not bad. Bijan Robinson had 30 carries, 100 yards, and five touchdowns, pretty solid. And Bijan also had 63 catches, 668 yards, and eight touchdowns, so not a lot of productivity with him, but he got a lot of catches though that's so i think that's pretty good he was third or he was fourth on the team in catches kyle pitts matt collins and drake london all did more but the defense though going the number five defense in the league that's pretty good that's actually really good aj terrell had seven interceptions so we have a lockdown cornerback so that helped out the case very much so and remember he was a 75 at receiver and 84 at running back so let's see what what overall he is now. I'm, I'm thinking maybe in the 80s at least because he was a 75 before. He's an 81 at receiver. Okay. Okay. That's actually really good. Stats look really good. So, hey, 75 to an 81. We change it back to running back. He'll probably go insane. But that's really good to see. 
And we're facing the Seahawks. I wonder how this will go. The offense is down the field at the one yard line. The game is tied 7 7. And defense gives up another touchdown. But our offense is going down the field to score. We do not. Well, we finally. Do we get a stop on defense? No, we do not. We're down 17 7. We finally score again. And we hold. We actually. Jason Myers actually missed the field goal. But we're still down by 10. Not doing much. Looks like the Seahawks defense is just holding it down. We're down by seven. And we ended up losing 27 to 20 at home. Ah, that's tough. Tough performance. Two touchdowns, one pick from Desmond Ritter. One pick and one touchdown from Geno Smith. So Desmond Ritter had a better game. Uh, Tyler Ogier was the leading rusher, unfortunately. Because I guess Cordero Patterson just lost his role. Bijan had five catches, 55 yards. Not bad. Drake Lennon, four catches, 47 yards, one touchdown. Bijan was the lead receiver on targets on targets because Matt Collins was lead on yards. And defense kind of let us down. With the number five ranked defense, we couldn't do much. Couldn't do much. And let's see who made the Pro Bowl. We got Arthur Smith's contract extended from putting uh, B. John Robinson at wide receiver. So I guess it was a good call for his, for his career as a coach. But I wish we had done more in terms of playoffs. But that's, again, still not bad. I mean, they made the playoffs. It's been a little bit. It's been some time since they made it. Last time was with Matt Ryan. So Super Bowl is actually Seahawks Ravens. So at least we got beat by a team that went to the Super Bowl. Let's see. So Pro Bowlers, none of our guys. Receivers, Bijan want to sneak in. Drake London did. Kyle Pitts did. Okay. Okay. That's actually really good. Chris Lindstrom made it, of course. I know our defense, we got some hitters that made it. Uh, Maybe this guy... M. Bell, I don't know which team he's on though. Is he on our team? I don't remember. AJ Terrell is not even the number one corner either. And Jesse Bates made it as well. So we got a couple Pro Bowlers. Bijan didn't sneak in, but I guess Bijan's better to be kept at running back in this Falcons offense. <music>